I'm Sam Burke, Corporate Chef for Meat and Livestock Australia. Today we're doing some creamy white polenta and slow roasted lamb shanks. So for our first step, I'm just going to lightly flour our lamb shanks. And this will ensure a nice colour when we go to see them off in the pan. Next step, some salt, cracked black pepper. Oil into the pan. We'll make sure our oil gets nice and hot so we get a nice sear. Now we place our lamb shanks straight into the pan. And now I'll remove my lamb shanks and put them into a deep gastronome. Our next step is to saute off our mirepoix that will nestle underneath our lamb shanks while we slow roast them. Some olive oil into the pan, followed by some garlic, bay leaf, onions, celery, and while that's sauteing, I'll just add some fresh thyme. And now I'll add my carrot. Now we want to sear those vegetables off so they're nice golden and brown prior to putting them on our tray and then nestling our lamb shanks on top for the cooking process. And finally, some oregano. Our mirepoix is now cooked. We'll remove it and put it into our gastro pan. And then add my lamb shanks. For the final step of my dish, I'll now return some stock to the pan and I'll bring that to the boil and I'm really deglazing all the juices from my mirepoix. I'll now add my tomato passata followed by the red wine. I'll bring that to a boil and then reduce to thicken. Now it's time to put our sauce on top of our lamb shanks and our lamb shanks into the oven for a slow roast. Baking paper on top followed by aluminium foil, tightly wrapped. Now we'll pop our lamb shanks into the oven. Now to slow roast our lamb shanks, we'll set the oven at full dry heat, temperature 160 degrees Celsius for two and a half hours. So we've removed our lamb shanks from the oven, place the lamb shank on top of our creamy white polenta and add some of our wonderful tomato sauce. And there you have it, our wonderful lamb shank on creamy white polenta.